Today, we have resided at the workshop of EATA, a Mercedes G63 of 2007, to make a key copy. Now we will show you the steps to follow to make the programming of keys with our machine 1360 Pro. We enter in the immobilizer section. We will look for the make a Mercedes and before we enter the procedure, it will tell us models and years of cars that allow key programming. We confirm and it tells us that we have to be connected to an internet network as we see in the picture. Apart from having connected the VCI to the vehicle, we also need to have connected the 360 Pro. We confirm that we have everything connected and it takes us to the menu of the make itself. The first thing we have to do to make a Mercedes key is the reading of the password of the anti-theft as we are in the car. Operation here, the one we are going to use to make a key programming. Having one working is the first option. We press on automatic identification with the key inserted in the EZS. It will detect what type of EZS carries the vehicle. We will accept as it have told us before. We need to have internet connection. We will insert and remove three times the key from the EZS and finally leave the key inserted. We are going to accept and then we remove the key from the EZS and put it in the PROC 360. and take out three times the easiest key. After that, we will press accept. This is the most important step because it tells us to turn the contact to see if we have light in the box. We remove the ignition and we leave the key inserted. After that, we press accept and we remove the key from the easiest. We put it back in the prog. And now we simply wait for it five to 10 minutes for it to give us the password during the process of obtaining the password, it may ask us several teams that we reinsert the key again. We insert the key three times and we check that when we are turning the key, we put it in contact. As we see, we put the contact perfectly, we remove the contact, and as you see, it has already given us the password. Also remember to take a picture of this password to use it later. It asks us if we want to want a backup of the data. We tell the machine if we save the name that we want, the license plate, VIN number, contact person, and we press accept apart from the password. We also need to read the data from the EZS. We want it for the replacement of the anti-theft module EIS EZS operation in the car, and we would read the module data it tells us by OBD or infrared if you have OBD in the car. That is, in this case, we would do it by OBD. If you had the old connector, it would go by infrared. The same automatic identification that automatically detects us what type of EZS is and already have the data asks us if we want to make a backup copy of the data. We always say yes. Once we have obtained the data of the EZS, we say yes, obtain the data of the EZS and the password. Next step would be to generate the key file. We will have to go to anti-theft key matches and generate key file DE to generate this file. It will ask us to select the data we have recorded from the EZS and will ask us the password that we have previously decoded. Once we have entered the password that we had previously taken a photo of, we press on accept and it gives us the key files that are used. And those that are unused, we always have to choose the last position that is unused. In this case, would be the key number. Six, we will select it in the next menu. We set the key number six, and we will generate the file of the key number six. It makes us a file safe. Important to keep the address. If we want to generate more files, we say yes and all. We have to do is select the key position to generate another file, more, in this case. As you only want a key, we say no, and to finish. We have to write the key file in the key itself, and now we would only need to insert the new key in the PROC360. We press on accept, and it will ask us for the file to be programmed. In this case, the key number is six. We confirm it, and it will tell us again if it is correct, the file we have chosen. We press, accept it communicates with the key, and once the writing is finished, the key is already programmed. We only have to check that it works and it will be ready. Simple, isn't it? Do you want to get to know more procedures to perform with our 360 PRO machine? Leave us a comment.